Hey guys, Hollow Master here. Today's video is of this inflatable snowman family. Um, this is one of the other ones I got in this bundle uh, with the 12 foot penguin. Um, there was about five of them, I think. Yeah, I think there's five of them. Um, but this is, I don't know the year, none of them had boxes, but um, this is definitely a knockoff version of the Jemmy one. Um, when this thing is inflated, you guys will know what I mean. Um, it had one of those El Cheapo cheap fans um, that had the two screws through it that they used in the early 2000s. Um, so, yeah. Um, I don't really have a whole lot to say about this item. Um, not yet, at least. I, I have to wait till it's inflated to point out what I wanted to. Um, so without further ado, I'll go ahead and inflate it. Comes up pretty quickly. So there it is. Um, like I said, you probably can tell right off the bat what, uh, what this kind of looks like from the from the Jimmy inflatable. So right off the bat, I want to point out, obviously, the little details like one's red and red with white polka dots, the other's green. But something else you might notice right off the bat is the green one's face is different than the red one. Well, weirdest thing ever. I've never seen this happen with an inflatable. His face did look like that one. You can actually see the adhesive where the cheeks peeled off, the mouth peeled off, the eyes peeled off. And um, I could have taken this, like I could have cut it off, but I decided I took some Flex Seal, some of the liquid Flex Seal, and um, I know it doesn't look quite like that, but at least it has a face. <laughs> I, I didn't even try to give it cheeks, but I have never, ever seen that happen on an inflatable. Now, it's not like the paint chipped or anything. I mean, it just, it peeled right off. Thankfully, it seems like these ones are on there pretty good, so so is his, so hoping that uh, stays that way, um, but uh, yeah, so it has one of those, um, oh, what fan did I put on it? I put the, um, one of the old snow globe fans on it, one of those little round ones, like the all round one. Um, works perfect for this thing I mean it's not really thin both of their hats are soft but other than that yeah, like, but there's no air coming out so I know it's not thin but like the rest of the fabrics crinkly so but uh, yeah um, and obviously it has five c7s one in each little guy three in the middle um the only thing i wish it had i wish the hat had more detail like the red brim or something i do have a holly berry i could give it but i don't feel like doing that just yet at or if at all but uh yeah so i'll set it back on the stand here and i'll go ahead and show it lights out it lights up pretty good for what it is. So yeah. And you can't really tell the difference other than it's thicker on that green one's face, but from the road you probably won't be able to tell. But at least I hope not. The interesting thing about this is it has three zippers. Each snowman has, has a zipper on the bottom of it. Now, obviously, the middle ones 
I, uh, the, you can't get to the zipper. That's where the fan is. Right now, I just have the hole where the other fan was taped up because you can't really zip tie it like shut. So I might put plastic over it or something. And then uh, it does have, I believe it has string holders. Yeah, it has string holders underneath the arms. So that'll be nice. Because those, the little guys only have weights. They don't have, you know. But with the way they're attached on there, they shouldn't have any issue. Because the bottom, obviously, is where the air goes in. But then their arms are, like, sewn on his back. So I think as long as that holds, it'll do just fine. Um, if I do four strings and then the four stakes, or however many stakes for the fan. So, yeah, guys. That's it for this video. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you in the next one. Peace out.